am making a microbiological portrait of myself uh, with agar and it's essentially a sculpture, living piece of artwork which will grow and die. Um, and the reason that I'm doing it is because people have never seen something like that and they've only ever seen it on dishes whereas making it into a sculpture and a face as well makes people kind of relate to it. Um, I'm working with Dr. Mark Clements, who is a lecturer uh, at the University of Westminster, and Richard, Dr. Richard Harvey, who is a lecturer at King's College. And they basically help me with all the scientific processes and teach me different things and share their knowledge with me, as well as me sharing my knowledge with them. And, having different perspectives. When I look at something, I'm looking through a scientist's eyes, and when an artist looks down, they're looking through a very, they're looking at it from a very different perspective. And I just find that uh, fascinating and brilliant. Um, and I think the, the probing questions that they ask, like I say, really contributes to my science as well. And actually through those collaborations, I've got into researching various aspects of um, science that I wouldn't have normally gone into. I found is that your way of seeing is very different but it also complements each other because you think oh I never thought of it that way or and getting getting time in the lab as well gets me out of my comfort zone which is what I like doing with my work because it's a challenge and it's exciting. <laughs>